Hey guys, Tom Aldred here. Um, just doing an update video. Uh, tomorrow is my day surgery when I get my plates removed because if you haven't watched uh, my last video, uh, my plates have given me an infection on this side and um, I need the plates taken out. Uh, I was originally going to get my day surgery, I think it was about not tomorrow, um, about a week or a week and a half away. But my surgeon wants me to have it tomorrow as the infection needs to be, you know, needs, I have to get rid of the infection because it's not good having infection in the jaw. It's not really good having any infection, but you know what I mean. And um, so yeah, but I've noticed like when I first discovered my infection, um, there was a massive lump at the back right near my back tooth. Um, and it was huge, but now after my um, I finished my tablets and that, it's actually gone down a lot. I mean, it's gone down heaps, and um, so yeah, I reckon if it was like this the day that um, he discovered um, the infection, because when he discovered it was huge, but if he like like it is now, I don't reckon. Um, I don't know. I might still need the operation tomorrow, but yeah, but. He said, we'll get it out because um, he, it's still there. So he said, it won't, it shouldn't like go away um, if you just take the tablets. So he said, get an operation and hopefully that just clears it up because um, the plates in my jaw have actually infected my um, my gum. So um, now. If I take the plates out of my mouth, will, will it affect my jaw because it's what's keeping it in place? Um, now, originally I wasn't meant to get my plates out for a year. Um, I don't think it's like, I don't think it's, they need to have them for a year. I think they just have it in for a year, just to, just like, just so they can. Because like, maybe it's, um, they have it for a year just to be safe, just to be sure. Then I was told uh, about seven months I can take have them taken out, but now I'm getting told um, I need it out tomorrow. And I said to my surgeon, "Do I need my plate? Is it all right to get my plates out so early? Because it's only been about three months." He's like, "Yeah, it'll be fine. It should be fine by now. It'll be it'll be good. You know, it's been three months." I'm like, "All right, whatever." Then I googled it, and yeah, the question was the question was how long will it? I'll have to wait to get my um, plates taken out my jaw and the question the answers were um, three months is long enough so yeah sounds like three months is long enough um, the swelling the swelling is still quite big it's this here this here is more more of a plate so um, I'm not actually quite sure because my surgeon said this a bit, of the, a bit of the lumps of plate and the rest is swelling, but I'm still swollen. I mean, this side is perfect, um, but this side is just, yeah, it's really frustrating. He said, um, when I get the plate taken out, the plate's taken out, the screws and that, it should be fine again. Um, but yeah, I should be, should that lump should go away and I should be alright. Um, now, I'm not quite sure, because it's only day surgery. I'm not completely sure what's going to happen tomorrow. Um, I'm not sure if he's taking the plates out both sides or he's taking the plates out the back or he's just taking this plate here out. I imagine he's taking the plate at the back where the actual infection is. But I'm not quite sure if he's going to take this plate out as well. Or what, I'm not sure what's going on. <clears throat> he said I'll still. He said I'll be swollen again. But he said we're nowhere near be like my major surgery I had. But um, yeah, so. I've watched YouTube videos of people getting operations done and post ops and that, and I haven't seen. I don't reckon I've seen anyone get an infection, or look like me. But you know, it's bad luck, and it happens to some people. Um, I'm sure I'm not the only one that has this problem. I know someone else, um, my friend's friend, who is still swollen after a year. Um, a really common surgery. Um, I don't. I don't know what to say. Like. If this doesn't go down, like if this doesn't go down, I mean, I guess I'm pretty happy with the surgery, but I mean, like, it's 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 definitely changed. It's not. I wouldn't say it's good. I mean, 
I don't want to look like this, you know what I mean? Well, I did the surgery to like, you know, have my jaw blow jaw forward and look better and that. And like, but I don't want to look like this, man, you know what I mean? Like, it's changed, it's changed like my life. And um, so I've never actually had day surgery before, so I'm not sure what to expect. Um, someone's comment um, on a video saying, when she got her wisdom teeth taken out, she just, you know, went for seven hours, went in the morning, stuff like that. So they said it's only about an hour and a half. I'll be under, I'm pretty sure. Um, yeah, so I imagine I'm going there at seven. I have to be there at seven. Same hospital, Bakefield Hospital. So I'll be there at seven. Yeah, for, uh, 12 o'clock tonight. It's four o'clock now. 12 tonight, I can't, I've stopped eating, drinking, whatever. got to fast to, um, so I've got to fast, yeah. Yeah, so I'm not really sure what to expect. So when I go in for an operation, like how big is that? Like you know what I mean? Like so I go in there, I I go put under. Did they put me under like fully? Or some people say I just go under like in a twilight, twilight drug. So um, I'll be put under. I'll be asleep, but not like dead asleep. I'm not. I actually have no idea what to expect for day surgery. I've never had it before. Um, I've done no research either. So I'm just you know hoping for the best. I'm not sure how I'm gonna feel like. I've been put under and I walk out, like, well, I feel all right, you know what I mean? Like, well, I feel fine to go home because there's no way I'm staying in a hospital again. Like, when I'm older, I probably might have to, but I'm not staying in, if it's day surgery, it's day surgery, you know what I mean? I'm not going another night in hospital, like, like it's, a, it's a really weird experience. Like, if it's just day surgery, I'm definitely going home. If they want me to stay me overnight, they can, you know, it's their own fault, but, yes, I'm not too sure what to expect. So, hopefully get it over and done with, be home. Uh, hopefully, hopefully soon, but a bit nervous, I'm a bit nervous now, I'm not heaps nervous though, I don't know, I'm just, I'm not sure if I should be nervous, like, it's a really weird feeling for me, I'm not sure if I should be nervous because it's just a day surgery, but then again, it's still an operation, I still have to go to sleep, etc, but yeah, so I'm completely fine, um, uh, getting my braces off pretty soon, uh, a few more weeks, I'm pretty sure, Day surgery tomorrow. I'll definitely do an update um, to, tomorrow after my surgery. Probably before and after, you know what I mean? And um, yeah, it should be good if you guys. I left this video a bit late. I know it's tomorrow, but if you guys are watching and you've had surgery before, can you answer my answer my questions? Because it'd be really, really nice. Like, because I don't know what to expect. So um, just like what I expect for day surgery. If anyone's watching, you have had their plates taken out. What, what it's, what's it like, you know what I mean? But yeah, so I left it a bit late. I haven't really been home much um, lately. So yeah, but I'll definitely do videos for you tomorrow. Um, yeah, so I do feel a lot better. Um, I'm looking a lot better. Uh, I can, I will look better. I mean, I still haven't fully recovered, but I'm definitely getting there. And yeah, so, I mean, I thought it would affect my jaw getting these plates taken out so early, but it turns out, it turns out it won't, so yeah, I'm pretty keen about that. And um, yeah, about the um, uh, before and after shot of my jaw, I'm gonna be taking one. Um, I was gonna take one the other week, um, but then I was just like, maybe I should just wait till I'm not as swollen for the best results. But yeah, I'm gonna try and organize that soon because um, because that'll be pretty interesting if you ask me. But yeah, so it's just been. Yeah, so um, the braces, because if you don't know, my jaw's a bit leveled differently. There's a bit of a gap on this side. Is a bit of a gap when I shut my teeth. You can't see it because my cheeks there, but it's a bit of a gap. And um, yeah, the braces, the braces. They say that it might not be leveled bec probably because of the braces, but when I take them off, it should be good. But I have a band there that's meant to like pull it down a bit and like you know stop that gap because it's hard to eat this side um, even though it looks better it's part of the eat because of the gap and how my upper jaw is angled so yeah more information on that later though but tomorrow day surgery I'll do some more videos for you stay tuned I know I've been doing much videos lately but I did say I'll stop slowly stop making videos I'll do videos now and then but yeah so tomorrow day surgery get my plates taken out stay tuned for more see you later